Rancho Cucamonga. And KCAL News reporter Rena Nakano is live with a look at how the mass shooting has affected the Lunar Festival there. Rena? Ladies, good evening. We are here, as you said, in Rancho Cucamonga. It's less than an hour away from that shooting site in Monterey Park, but festivities do continue here. Take a look. There are 30 vendors, just food vendors alone, plus 50 merchants at this location. Let me tell you a little bit of the background of Rancho Cucamonga here. Definitely a large AAPI community, and the organizer we spoke to said that he wanted to bring this AAPI tradition, this Lunar New festival to this city specifically because they wanted to celebrate the community. Unfortunately, that an incident in Monterey Park happened last night. So the event coordinator had to get on the phone with the city of Arancho Cucamonga as well as the police department and said, is it safe for us to actually continue on to day two, which is today? They all decided that yes, we're going to beef up security, have a lot more police patrolling the entire area, and yes, we are going to continue it. But again, look at all of the food and vendors that are out here. Many of the vendors we actually spoke to said we got the call from the organizer this morning saying, yes, you know what? I know that a lot of other Lunar New Year events have been canceled because of what happened in Monterey Park. However, we're going to continue and we want you guys to stay here with us. Take a look. We have many more activities, many more kids zones, and we actually have another vendor right over here. She's a small caterer out of Los Angeles, and we're going to talk with Yuki from Suki Yuki. Tell us a little bit about how you found out about the incident in Monterey Park this morning. Oh, I I heard about it from one of my friends this morning, so he was very shocked and scared, but we have to do what we could. And uh, I'm very sorry for the family and victims. Like, yeah. A lot of people, vendors just like Yuki, said the same thing. They feel very sorry for what happened in Monterey Park, but they still got to do what they got to do. Many of these vendors are actually mom and pop restaurants who they say going to events like this is their livelihood. So they cannot cancel. They have to push on. They did notice that there's a lot fewer people here at the event today compared to yesterday, which was day one. However, they are, you know, feeling the sadness behind Lunar New Year. However, when they see the people walking around, they see that a little bit of them still wants to celebrate the Year of the Rabbit, and this is how they're doing it. Ladies? Rena, ask you a question. Did you, did you notice a heightened sense of uh, security? Do you see a lot of security or a lot more security there tonight than, uh, say, was there yesterday or than normal? I actually was not here yesterday, but the uh, the event organizer did say that there's a lot more people patrolling. I did see a couple of EMTs walking around with the stretcher just because in the very front of this entire area, I did see another park ranger. Uh, don't know if they're normally here. However, that presence alone makes it really seem like they have beefed up security. But I do know the city of Rancho Cucamonga definitely has a lot of city people out here patrolling. There's a lot of people invest that I see in this area as well. So yes, security has been beefed up. I also talked uh, about the organizer about organizing similar events like this in the coming weekends uh, to celebrate the Lunar New Year. He said that they are going to continue. Many of these vendors are contracted to be there in Riverside next week for a similar event. They said that they are going to be continuing, of course, uh, sending prayers and thoughts to the people and the Lunar Festival that happened, uh, that was supposed to happen today in Monterey Park. But they still said that they are going to continue through next week. Yeah, sometimes it is a sense of community uh, that can help people grieve through a situation. Rena, thank sure. you. All right, thanks, Rena. Well, actor Cherry Cola is at the Sundance Film.